Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today is the update and we have a holidays dungeon and holiday dungeon quest available. So in this video, I'm going to just tackle the holiday dungeon. I tried it once, um, I think it's very very doable and it costs 10 keys which is pretty a lot. Pretty, pretty, pretty heavy cost actually. But okay, not to worry. I'm gonna do one round with this team, okay? And I'm gonna do another round with a uh, very new new player kind of recommended hero team. Okay, so these are my masteries. Oops. I think, uh, oops, sorry. I'm gonna put it up. This needs to go down. Five target for sure. Can't remember what's this. And physical. Okay. So this is gonna be my mastery and it's gonna I'm gonna use this team which is really overkill I would say. As you can see. The heroes are really not threatening at all. Eight seconds, okay, eight seconds. So the additional reward is because I'm using a Yushun. So I'm gonna just tackle this dungeon again with very um, new player kind of setup. So I'm gonna use my Velika. Uh, where's my Fong Yen? Okay, my Fong Yen. Okay, not even gonna use this tool. Um, Mastery's gotta flip down if that's the case. Okay, we're gonna try this. Simple. Okay, maybe my Yushin is a bit um, equipped. But okay, look at this. You know my Feng Yan only has one weapon. And uh, he managed to do that. So I think it's very, very doable and it's uh, totally meant for uh, new players. Okay, so what can you get from this dungeon? For the first dungeon, you can get um, heroes. And it's super easy to get. I mean, currently I already have 41 points, so I am going to trade in for a special hero selector. Okay? So for the second one, is all awakened items, and oh my goodness, this shop is super amazing. 5 transcended plus 10 7 night weapons. I mean, come on, that is crazy. That is, you're gonna get so many HP armor uh, at plus 10 for, for arena. You're gonna get... You're even gonna get a lot of lethal plus 10 items. Yeah. This is very, very... This is like the best, best event ever, really. New players are gonna catch up so fast. You're gonna have a lot of very good uh, lethal heroes. You're gonna have Lupu and Jave fully equipped, ready to go in arena. Super awesome. So for the third dungeon, um going to have accessories and this is also a very cheap way to get a willful ring. Hopefully, hopefully you get uh, the Lux one which is 4 times, uh, 4 turns I mean. And for the final one, it is actually a jewel, jewel dungeon and you're going to get four of all ticket, okay. Ticket is fine, ticket is fine. Selector will be better of course, okay. So I'm going to tackle the second dungeon here as well. Over here we need an Aragorn. I'm going to use my Awakened Aragorn. Once again, I'm going to just use uh, Feng Yan and Velika. I have not went into this dungeon, so no idea what to expect. If they actually... Okay, so... Very basic. Okay, that's Chloe, Awakened Chloe. You cannot escape from these so this time, these heroes are more tank. More bulky because they have immunities. So it's gonna take a while. But they don't do that much damage to you as you can see, so it's uh, totally safe. So, if you have Feng Yan and Velika, I think you are very well. You're very good to go because Feng Yan and Velika are meant to, you know, remove hit shields. And these heroes have hit shields. They also pierce. So, I don't see you having a big problem over here. 
cannot escape from these blades. The only problem is here. <laughs> this is our problem. So Chloe is quite a pain. Uh, she has four immunities, four, four, four void shields, and four turn immunities. And now she just gained HP shield and three more void shields. So. Good for me. And she also increases cooldown. So, if you're gonna go in with this team, this is what you're gonna expect. This is my first time in, so great. Good for me. Great, for me as a week. Okay. Okay. So, if you, uh, maybe you will want to come in with, um, you over here you can if you don't have a uh, very strong heroes you can actually come in with uh, Elisha. Elisha will prevent you from being stunned. Or you, if you have Ares, I think Ares will be good. But you know she will she, she won't be doing anything for this dungeon. Uh, if you do have a Mao Song, also good to bring him because he provides uh, immunity for cooldown. Okay. So alternatively, if you have very strong heroes like J for five man AOE with Tio. Uh, with 5 man AOE, go ahead and bring them. I think uh, you have no problem clearing the dungeon for sure. Yeah, I'm just gonna go in like that. So this is my second run. I think Wild Fury is going to do a lot of work here, which is great. So Teal is a very... Uh, Awakened Teal is a very good character for, you know, all these kind of dungeons. Because both his skills are super useful. They decrease buff duration for one skill, and the other skill also pierces. Okay, so that was this dungeon. Of course, you can do it in a much faster way. No problem at all. Okay, so I hope uh, this video actually shows you a little bit of how to tackle. If you're still very confused, uh, what's this dungeon about and what can I get out of it, you can actually get amazing, amazing stuff. So don't forget to attempt it every day and start clocking all your... and start gathering, you know, all your uh, currencies to exchange for all the gifts that the dungeon provides, okay? So, uh, till next time, I'll see you in my next video. 